If iPhone mirroring is not working on your MacBook Pro, MacBook Air or any other Mac devices running on Mac OS Sequoia and you're getting errors like unable to connect to iPhone, iPhone not found, maybe it shows iPhone in use even when your iPhone is locked or if it's stuck on connecting to and keeps disconnecting and shows connection interrupted or timed out, then let me show you some easy to follow troubleshooting steps that will help you fix any iPhone mirroring issues on your Mac device with Mac OS Sequoia. First of all, if you're having issues setting up the iPhone mirroring feature on your Mac device, then you'll need to make sure that you have passcode enabled on your iPhone, then Wi-Fi and Bluetooth turned on on both your devices. If these weren't the issue, then you can simply restart your iPhone and your Mac, then try the iPhone mirroring feature again and this time it should work. But in your case, if iPhone mirroring stopped working suddenly and now you're getting errors like unable to connect, or it's stuck on connecting to, etc., then simply resetting the connection should fix it. To do that on your Mac, you'll need to have iPhone mirroring turned on, then simply tap on iPhone mirroring, go to settings, and click on revoke access. Then you'll be able to set up iPhone mirroring once again. But if you're unable to do it from your Mac, then you can also do it from your iPhone. Just go to settings, then general, then go to airplay and continuity, open iPhone mirroring, now just swipe left on your MacBook and hit delete. Now you can go back to your Mac and you will see the setup prompt. Even if resetting connection didn't work or you were unable to set it up in the first place, then simply log out of your iCloud account on your Mac, restart your Mac, then log back in. Now launch the iPhone mirroring app once again and you should be able to set it up using the setup prompt. But in your case, if you're still stuck in unable to connect, then this can happen if you have an unsupported region selected. So to check that, open settings, go to general, then language and region, and make sure that it's set to a supported region such as United States. After changing the region, just open back iPhone mirroring and the unable to connect error should go away, allowing you to set up the iPhone mirroring feature on your MacBook. Now you should be able to use your iOS device using iPhone mirroring on macOS Sequoia. If this helped, let us know in the comments, drop a like, subscribe to our channel for more and I'll see you in the next one.